Good morning, happy peoples. Hope your day is going awesome. Hope things are going great for you. I don't know about you, but I'm starting to feel way more encouraged. And I don't know why, maybe it's the sun. Is it because the sun's out? I'm, I'm not sure. I, I just, for some reason, I am just encouraged that we're getting through this. By the way, Alaska, uh, I just looked here, I think yesterday, and of course things can change day by day, but uh, we have the lowest number of cases in the entire United States right now uh, of the sickness that's running around. And we also have the lowest number of deaths. Now, of course, any deaths are too much, uh, trust me. But keep in mind, we also have the lowest amount of, of hospitals and, and uh, medical facilities here. So I'm really glad that our state, sorry about the wind, we're really glad our state has has pulled everyone together and everyone here really kind of just got on board for the most part and it seems to be good. So I actually have to go do something today that I've not done in months. I normally find this very boring and I don't know, is this considered life threatening now? It might be, I'm gonna go to Walmart. I'm gonna actually walk into Walmart and because <laughs> we need to get some office stuff for this, uh, for this launch that we're doing. And there's also some other things that I've just been putting off, uh, some filters for the water. Let me, let me show you. I attempted to take a bath last night and this is what came out of the faucet. Yeah. So I'm gonna go try to get some water filters while I'm there, I'm trying to get some random things, um, go shopping. And I guess just see, I, I don't think Walmart is really shut down here. Let us know maybe where you're at. Has Walmart shut down or any of the major stores shut down or could you still kind of go in for your, you know, general purpose stores like a Walmart. So I think that's about the only thing on the agenda for today other than the normal stuff, school, and my wife's working on some website stuff, and it's just, the wind is blowing, the sky is clear. Oh, I might share some updates for Alaska, some things that are happening. It sounds like we're starting to open up a little bit, which is great, which is awesome, but not like a full open up. And I'm also curious to see your take on that too. Um, is it, do you think it's too soon to open up? Should we all lay, lay low for a while? Or should we like, you know, leave it in people's own hands to say, hey, if you don't feel safe to go out, just don't go out. Curious to see your take on that, but let's get started with the day. We just, we so appreciate each and every one of you being a part of this YouTube family. You, you, you really don't know how much you mean to us. So um, thank you, thank you for being here. Thank you for being a part. So let's get started with the day and let's go to Walmart. Hope you guys are doing fantastic. It's sunshiny today. My kids are out on the trampoline. They're jumping like crazy fiends, Sam. It's a beautiful day here, which I'm so grateful for. It's sunshiny, can't complain. We are hard at work here, getting stuff squared away. I know I don't want to talk about um, launching and whatnot for every vlog because that's not our intent you guys know that this is just something that's new and that we are working hard on so that this will not be a regular thing where we talk about this a lot anyway we are hard at work all shipping is inputted so we are golden we are ready to rock and roll all international all domestic that is what i have been working on all morning almost done almost completely done and ready to rock and roll so if you're watching this we are launching tomorrow 8 a.m alaska standard time <laughs> I'm excited. Okay, enough about that. My babe is on his way into town to take on the craziness. So I like to package 
special little things in the packages that you guys order. So like creating like a little picture with like a thank you note kind of on it was super important to me and I've done it with all my launches. So I was like, babe, uh, this is where I normally get these done and they do a really, really fantastic job. And can you go get them? <laughs> so he's on his way to Walmart to go get those for me. And actually so many things are open here now which is kind of crazy. I travel between communities now. Um, I really, really, really want to go to the Kastner Glacier, which is about two hours or so away from here. Um, but we didn't because there was a mandate saying, you know, don't travel to another community. Oh, I really, really want to go because it's so beautiful. And now I'm like, I wonder if it's too melted to go. I want it to be safe for the kids anyway. So we might try to go do that. Take you guys to a glacier. Not today that if you want, if you go to Costco, um, and this applies to all Costco's or I believe around the, the country is that you have to wear a mask. Anybody has to wear a mask except two year olds and down. Um, or if you have a medical condition which requires you not to wear one. So keep that in mind. If you were gonna venture out into Costco, I think they're starting to implement that. My kiddos are actually going to head on down to Nana's house. Um, our internet is not functioning really here to be able to stream the kids' school. So we've been kind of, you know, you've heard of that struggle of ours. We'll go down to my mom's because she gets great internet um, and be able to work down there. So I think that's what they're gonna do. Uh, my mom is actually gonna come pick them up because Bert has the, has the vehicle. All right, so let us go check in on Bert and see how he's doing as he braves the Walmart. Cover me, I'm going in. So do you guys think we'll see a lot of people wearing masks? Everybody wearing masks, some, almost none? Curious. Here's the big question. To glove or not to glove? That is the new question. All right, let's go get our stuff. Okay, let's roll. Got a big order of pictures, I guess, my wife sent in. Summers, S O M E R S. Hi, Mom. Bye, love you. Be good. night what have we done the question is can I get done everything that I that I need to get done while they're away let's go I want to be there and baby dance the night away I let my head down if I want don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time doesn't sound like fun you can do better Let me show you what a good time looks like You can do better So much better If I want Let yourself be free And maybe you will find That there is more to life Than being pretty Honey, let's just be sick You can do better I'll show you How goes it, babe? I'm walking around Walmart It's so weird you need to hurry And get out yep. of there, please It'll be fine Yes, it'll be fine I'm gonna go by the magazine rack For a bit, hang out I don't know. Might get something to eat while I'm here. <laughs> Is anybody else wearing masks? Uh, I'm gonna say maybe 40% of the people are, yes. Quite a few. 
Were you able to get that? <clears throat> yep. Just got him. Okay. Let me go get the other stuff. I'll be here. All right. Okay. Love you. Bye. Okay, I'm gonna say roughly 30 to 40% of the people here wearing masks, which is pretty impressive. And for the most part, things seem pretty chill. So that's awesome. My wife is stressing out about having me in here too much, but you know what I should do is like a random like shopping video, you know, where she will grab a product and like show the price. <laughs> Let me do that for some random stuff. That'd be fun. makes me miss the old days, which was a few months ago, where you just come into stores and hang out, take as much time, no stress, no worries. Ah, I hope we'll get back to this soon. around here right that say like stay six feet apart all you got to do though is just kind of clear your throat if someone's kind of pushing on your business just to <coughs> do one of those oh loads of space loads of space <laughs> Leave me a comment down below. Let me know, are you comfortable going out right now? And if so, do you feel like you have to wear a mask or not? Let me know. Let me know, are you comfortable going out right now? But this is uh, this is definitely been a fun experience. I'm gonna go home, full shower, wipe down all the things. Yes. Okay, first, Little Debbie's. Probably go drop my clothes and uh, um, drop my clothes in the uh, in the garage. Do a full shower just to be extra safe. I don't know. Are we being overkill? Maybe we are. All right. So I was supposed to go in for two things. It turned into a little man shopping spree. <laughs> I'd say I did pretty good. I think. You know, I started seeing all these fun things. I I got some Clorox wipes. Did you see that? There was one on the shelf, and I spotted it. And I was like, there's people walking by. I'm like, is someone going to grab it? No one's going to grab it. Why is nobody going to grab it? So I got the last Clorox wipes, which is amazing. Um, I guess I should have checked for toilet paper. Man. It's okay. I got a red ball, though. A multi-pack of something? I don't even know what that is, but I bought it. Wild guess. How much did I pay for my fun man spree? I paid, dun-da-dun-da-dun, $180.43. 
zero tax because we don't have sales tax here. I'm in Fairbanks, so the closest we have to North Pole, we have to drive to Fairbanks. It's about 15, 20 minutes away. My water filter is 57 bucks. So that's a big chunk of it. Like $76 of just water filters. Okay. Headed back home, washing, being safe. That was a cool experience and it shouldn't be an experience because it's going to Walmart. Why is going to a store an experience now? Weird times in the world. We do. How'd I do? How'd I do? You like my ball? What? what it's for the kids. It's outside. Oh my. Just, this is it's not been wiped down. Get your hands back. This is Come gonna on. get real muddy. It's gonna get real muddy. That's okay. Give me a wipey. All right, there we go. Oh my. Look, I got some health food. I don't think we had that game. Do we have that game? Yeah, they just played it yesterday. Oh no. It's okay. We can keep one at Nana's. It was like seven bucks. Okay. I'm gonna put it on the trampoline. Oh, there you go. Throw it in there. Make the shot. Make the shot. That would have went. Woo! So my babe came. You saw he came, dropped off the um, groceries that he just randomly went and did like a shopping spree. My babe came and left. Um, he had to go to one of our jobs, one of our projects, um, to drop off some controllers because our guys, like he said, he was they were working nights. So he went and did that. Okay, so I am gonna hop in the car and I'm gonna go run down to Nena's, get the kiddos, and we actually might go on a fun walk. We did this yesterday where we went and walked the bike path. The bike path has no snow on it. Hallelujah, praise. So I might go do that. Um, it's really important for her to get out of the house and like active and stuff because it's not good, especially when you're by yourself, you know? I even did laundry. I even got my sheets in the dryer. Look, I'm like doing, I'm air drying my pillows. So fresh and so clean. Who else loves um, fresh bedding? I love fresh bedding. It's like my favorite. Since Bert was not feeling good, I was like, eh, I probably should wash. I probably should wash everything. So let's jump in the car, head on down to Nens, and go for a fun walk. Hi. Want your walk? What? Don't shush, shrug your your shoulders. Aren't you? Oh my gosh, we're no gonna get ran over. one else makes me feel this way. Don't know what you do. Hold my hand, could you hold my hand? Look me in the eyes. You and me, yeah, that's all I need. And I'll be alright. Okay, so we made it out to the bike path. Sorry, my lighting is a little bit bad, but it is uh, it's a little late. It's like 9.30 or so, but you know, getting our exercise in. So yeah, I think we're gonna call this one a night, guys. Thank you guys so much for coming along. We're gonna go and enjoy our walk with the kiddos, with Nena. Daddy actually had to come back and run back into town to go drop off more pieces and parts. So it's his third time. It's his third time into town. But you know what? I can tell his countenance, like, his demeanor, like, he seems happier. I think because he was able to get out, he was able to be around other people. It's amazing when you miss that socialization of like, not even being like next to people, but like, just like in and around other people. So hey, our walk, yeah. it is still a little bit frigid, but we're not letting that deter us. It's probably about 35 degrees right now and it's a bit windy. Yeah. But anyway, I think we're gonna call this one a night. Uh, don't forget, just a reminder, it's on Friday, so tomorrow, Saturday, May 2nd, 8 a.m. Alaska Standard Time, we'll be launching the Fireweed Hoodie. So if you're wanting one of those, make sure that you are at the site, 8 a.m., and then we will go live. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.